TID Radio TDH3 Ham. Unboxing, setup, programming, and demo. Got that coming up next. Bill from Ham Radio Basics here. If you like the content of this video or anything on my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any future content. With that, let's begin. Earlier this year, TID Radio sent me the TDH8 second generation to review. I thoroughly enjoyed doing that, and I really fell in love with TID Radio. Well, they sent me out their new TDH3 ham to go ahead and do the same thing. So we're going to go ahead and do the unboxing, the setup, the Bluetooth programming, and the, te and the demo of it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do an unboxing of the TID Radio TDH3 ham. You can see their boxes are pretty uh, very plain. They don't really have a whole lot of information on them. Let's go ahead and open it up. Uh, TDH3 two-way radio user, user manual ham radio. They do a great job in these manuals. They're very descriptive, very detailed, and it's in everyday ordinary English. It's very easy to understand, very easy to find everything uh, on, in the manual and on the radio itself. They correspond very nicely. And they do include a nice section on the uh, Bluetooth programming as well. And I give you a card that helps you with warning information or customer service. Uh, you can contact them there. Yeah, it's the charging brick for it. And there's the USB cord. And that's the battery clip. And there's a screw with that. And here's the antenna. There's the charging base. And there's the strap. And here is the radio. Okay, let's go ahead and get the antenna on it. You can see the functions are very clearly indicated on the front of the radio. The keypad is much smaller than the H8. That's a light that you can turn on. And there's access right there, access ports. They're covered up very nicely. There's the back of the radio. And the push to talk. And contacts for go ahead and put sticking in the cradle. Go ahead and get it charged up. Okay, that was the unboxing and setup. Let's go ahead and show the Bluetooth programming for the TID radio. TDH3 ham. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do the Bluetooth programming. First, we need to turn the radio on itself. And now, what you want to do is hold the blue button. I'm going to actually shut off the Bluetooth. And then you need to hold it again for several seconds to turn the Bluetooth back on. And we'll turn the volume down there. And then you want to go ahead and get your phone and open up the app. And it's the Odd Master app. You need to set up an account, so and I've already done that. So we're going to go ahead and log in and search in Bluetooth. Now you're looking for Kit K I T, so you find that you're good. Now you want to go ahead and select the model. Now remember, this is the TID Radio TDH3 Ham. So you go ahead and select that. And I'll hit read, and you're reading the channels on the radio itself. Okay.
Okay, that's complete. Now you can go ahead and skip these menus right here. And you want to go ahead and select repeater list and you take a look at the repeaters in your area. We're going to select the first one and I want to put that to channel one. And we go ahead and hit import and select right. Now you can do multiple ones. I just did one in this instance just for demonstration purposes. And you can see there's a status bar showing it's downloaded. Okay, that's completed. And you can see that we verified it. Here, let's go to channel one. Okay, and it, it matches what we put in there. So it was programmed successfully. And last but not least, let's go ahead and do a demo of the TDH3 AMP. Kilo Whiskey 4, Quebec Oscar testing. Kilo Whiskey 4, Quebec Oscar testing. Kilo Whiskey 4, Quebec Oscar testing. Kilo Whiskey 4, testing. All in all, I was very impressed again with TID Radio. I think one of their hallmark features for me is the ease of programming it via Bluetooth. Question of the day. What did you think of the TID Radio TDH3 ham unboxing, setup, programming, and demo? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks so much for watching, and remember, it's a great day to make a QSO. 7-3s, everyone.